There was an unusual attraction in Croydon where the audience saw the national final for the Minister of Health's Challenge Cup. The stage set was a hospital ward of 18 beds, such as they might be in a wartime emergency, and four teams of the National Hospital Service Reserve showed how they would play their part after a nuclear attack. Each team was given particulars of the 15 casualties in the beds and then left to get on with it. Like all members of the reserve, the casualties are volunteers. They're made up so realistically that people seeing them have been known to faint at the sight of painted wounds. The idea is that if the volunteer member of the reserve saw the real thing, they'd be able to take it in their stride. It's a sort of new slant on amateur dramatics. A surgeon and three nurses acted as judges. Eight supposed casualties were brought in as each group was at work. Four teams were competing, Winchester, Newsham, Liverpool, Huddersfield and Southend. Talented actors, some of these casualties. Radiation burns they're supposed to be. The South End team was the only one of the four that included a man. 160 teams from all parts of the country originally entered the competition. On behalf of South End, Derek Schofield received the cup from Lord Newton. We owe a debt to the hospital service reserve, but may their casualties continue to be painted ones.